The Costs of Inaction on Climate Change Climate change is real, and it's happening, but it's not just about weather patterns. It's about the American economy, and it's about our jobs. The American Security Project has produced a series of 50 reports which analyze and project possible economic losses if we do nothing about climate change. The state-by-state -state reports also outline the opportunities we have if we start to invest in renewable, clean sources of energy and energy efficiency measures. Pay Now, Pay Later, or PNPL, draws attention to the costs of inaction for each state if America fails to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. The reports show there will be costs to our economy, security, competitiveness, and public health, and that the costs of inaction will be steep for each region. In the Great Lakes states, over 30% of the workforce is projected to be at risk. The Great Lakes are projected to significantly fall 25% over the next several decades. In the plains, an increase in temperatures coupled with an increase in rainfall could cost the Midwest billions each year in lost agricultural profits. In the West, for example in Alaska, melting permafrost is expected to add billions to Alaska's public infrastructure costs in the next 20 years. By the 2040s, elevated temperatures are expected to decrease snowpack in the Cascade Mountains, leading to seasonal water shortages and droughts. Energy costs in the Southeast will rise by nearly 60 billion by 2100 as a result of increasing temperatures. In the Southwest, Lake Mead could dry up as soon as 2021, leaving people across the region without a dependable water supply. In New England, with sap flow falling, the production of maple syrup, an industry which has prospered there for centuries, will be seriously diminished, resulting in millions of losses across the Northeast region. For the Mid-Atlantic states, climate change severely threatens the coastline. A Category 3 hurricane would flood Lower Manhattan. Damages would likely cost $200 billion or more. And in Maryland, islands have already disappeared due to rising sea levels in the last 100 years. Many more in the Chesapeake Bay and further offshore are likely to face the same fate. Climate change will have a cost. We can either pay it now to invest in transforming our energy economy, or we can pay significantly higher economic and social costs in the future as we play catch up and try to adapt to the impact of climate change. How much is climate change going to cost you? Find out at americansecurityproject.org.